it is, man. What's what's the problem with her? Like, just overall, like, what's the issue? I think overall it's just the attitude thing. It's the same reason why Norb's like, you know, people like are socking him everywhere he goes. Like that was bound to happen. Um, you can't relate this to battle rappers again. Like maybe people are gonna watch this and be like, well, you got attitude, and battlers have attitude, and yeah, people like me, Arsenal, Cossack, or whoever, we're disrespectful human beings, but. You know, when it comes to handling things professionally, we're not like that at all. We're all fucking, you know, we're all good people, man. And just Ur, just, he still hasn't got to that point where he just, he doesn't want to, like, be the small, like, the bigger guy or smaller guy in the situation, I guess. Because he just doesn't want to, like, let people talk to him and step down and be like, yo, bro, like, because we're, anyone would be willing to talk to him and be friends with him if he could just, sit down and talk like yo I made a mistake here and here yo I got love for you guys this is hip hop that let's get together he never tries that you know what I'm saying so like Ur is really weird about the shit you know what I mean he ignores people he does crazy ass shit he stops responding you can't deal with him like an adult so it's like you know what I did what I did in the event like he, like you know don't flop or all mad and saying that it was like desperate on Sketch Menace's part. First of all, I did this shit for Sketch Menace. That was one of the reasons because I'm that type of person, bro. Like, I've told you the, I've told you people this a million times. I care about the battlers, bro. And like, it's just, I don't know, man. Like, when I start thinking about all this shit, bro, like, we came from a long way, man. And like, I don't like seeing other battlers get treated like, you know, I, I know how it feels to like have a dream and have a huge matchup and have something big like going on for you. Like, you know, Sketch Menace was on world domination. This was his biggest battle and he prepared for a while. And you know, a lot of them were saying like, oh, they knew like 10 days in advance. No, they didn't because yeah, Ur probably said some shit and just vanished, you know what I'm saying? So he left people wondering whether he was gonna come or not. You know what I mean? Like, he did the same shit to me. He didn't give me my itinerary to like the last couple days. Like, I didn't know if I was gonna battle, bro. Like when I was, when I was battling unanimous, like, my first round is flawless, second round flawless. If you look towards, like, the third round, it's just choppy and shit. Like, I didn't have time to prepare for it because Ur left me hanging wondering if I'm coming or not. You know what I mean? Same shit he did with them. Like, you know what I mean? So, you know, I think it's a thing with Ur where he just has to come to his senses and talk to people. That's it. That's all it takes. Him working things out and everybody will be cool with him. You know what I mean? He's just too much of a... He's paranoid, he's just a sketchy human being, bro. He trips out and like, he's always paranoid and he thinks people are after him. I don't know what it is, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Like, what we did was art, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna slap the guy, I'm not gonna hit him. You know, I had my little thing with him that was completely separate for spitting on him and shit, but like, I would never like, you know, attack or anything like that. Or people here wouldn't attack or He's not the type of person that needs to be attacked, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is art, like what we do. We kill people with our talent. And and that's something that you guys can't fucking take from me and you can't do nothing about it. You can probably try to respond with a parody or do some shit and I'll respond 5,000 times harder. You're gonna drown yourself. There's no way getting out of it. I'm too talented at these type of things. As fucking full of myself as it sounds. I just have to be honest. Like, I could do whatever it takes, whatever. But, you know, so you just gotta take it like it was a funny thing and people should just laugh about it, you know? Like, you know, Liam and all of them, they're really mad. And, I told them they should just watch the interview with Battle Rap Chris. I told them, you know, I'll tell, tell you again. This is nothing against anyone from Don't Flop. We love all those motherfuckers, especially the British fans, man. Like, don't ever get it misconstrued, you know what I'm saying? Like, England has some of the day oneers, the ones that have been with us since Jump Off, since they got some seasoned fans out there. We love them motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? So, you know. Don't let one person's fucking, you know, and I say this to all the Americans and Canadians, you know what I'm saying? Don't let one person ruin your, you know, view on a group of people. Like, you can't you can't put it like, don't flop, or England, or the Brits, or whatever, you know what I mean? It's just her, and her needs to just come to his senses, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not the only person he has problems with. I mean, pff, clearly, he has problems with everybody, you know what I'm saying? Like, so... No question. So there was a rumor going around saying that, like, he found out he, he was on booked on the same flight as you. And that's Booked why on the same flight as me? Yeah, there was a rumor going around saying that. That like basically he had a layover in the same city you did. And he was like, Are you oh, serious? Fuck. I had no idea. No, no, I don't know that, but that's a well, rumor. Well, my going layover around. was New York. So, I Apparently mean, Apparently he had the maybe, same layover and maybe he was taking he the same flight here and he found out. And that's, I don't know. That's crazy, bro. 
Well, we could find out if that's the case, you know what I'm saying? We could find out, like, if I would have seen Ur on a plane, bro, the worst I would have did to him, if I seen him on a plane, is turn on my phone and be like, what's going on, Erg? Like, what's going on, bruv? You're doing good in the battle. You're gonna kill it, bruv. You got your bars with you, bruv. I would have just... What am I gonna do to Ur on an airplane? Like, I'm, I'm Arab. Like, what am I gonna do on an airplane? Especially to him. He makes me look worse standing next to him on an airplane. I'd stand the furthest thing away from him if we were on an airplane together. I'm trying to make it to my battle. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know if that's true or not. And if it is, that's fucking, like, that's... That's sucker shit considering that I had spoke to Bamalan, tweeted publicly, and told people, yo, it's all respect, like, Ur's gonna come and have a good battle, no one's gonna fuck with him, because I know he was worried about it, you know what I mean? Anybody would worry about it if they have a battle and they have to deal with other side shit, I understand that. But when someone talks to you and tells you, like a grown man, like, okay, everything's cool, like, why are you still tripping? Really, it's like to that point where you just don't trust anything and you're just shook of the whole fucking world and you know That's not gonna work for you. Where are you gonna keep battling in Croatia on boats and shit like that? Fuck off, man. What are you gonna fucking do? Don't feel up Wisconsin, bro it's, You're you know, it's good. You're doing all that shit, you know, what I mean like but get back to the shit You know what I'm saying get back to stop causing a divide in the shit make it one family man Like we don't need to fucking divide leagues don't ever need to be battling each other the battlers need to kill each other and That's it, bro so I don't know what to tell you, man. That, that's it. I'm sick of this conversation, but you got other questions? I'm not talking about her anymore, bro. I'm done talking about her. Made this fucking guy famous as fuck.